What is going on, you guys? Welcome back to another video. It is your boy, Koi Cam, aka The Video Hunter. And in today's episode, we're still playing catch up. This was back in, uh, I want to say August, because it was uh, right before the kids started school. Uh, we took them um, school shopping, uh, and it happened to be in the same area of one of my favorite hunting holes to hunt VHS, and that is the St. Vincent de Paul in Fremont, California. Uh, so I made sure to make a quick stop. Um, dirt cheap at this place always talk about this place i always go to this place so you guys know i went home with a bunch of tapes again anyway let's get right into it we are almost uh all the way caught up um with our hunts um so probably like two or three more episodes and we should be all the way caught up with the hunts and then we can start shooting some new new content new material so um yeah let's get right into the video guys
This, you guys see all these boxes right here? This is all filled with tapes. Um, I remember a few episodes ago, I talked about a big thousand tape haul and we still haven't gotten to that box. This, these, all part of the same haul. And here is today's haul. Yeah, I know, I'm a tape hoarder. Uh, can't help it, but here is today's stack of tapes. These three right here. I got exactly 55 pieces, which equals out to 11 bucks at that store. Um, so it seems like I spent a lot, but I didn't. I only spent 11 bucks and got this whole three stacks of tapes. So here is the three stacks that we got for today. Um, let's just go through them. I'll just try to go through all of them so I can show you guys. Um, I mean, no reason for me to rush. Sit back, go grab a drink, and uh, we're going to check out what we got for today. Uh, starting off with this stack right here, right on top, Michael J. Fox, Back to the Future. Um, anytime I see this in the wild, and especially for cheap, I am going to grab it because there's always a new collector in the VHS game, and this is one of the basics that they usually want. Um and a lot of people don't have this in their collection. Even as even as longtime collectors, they just don't have it yet sometimes. So um, always grab that. That's a sure winner. Next one, another Michael J. Fox. This one's The Secret of My Success. I already have this, so this is for resale. I always grab random um, rental clams uh, for my custom VHS that I make. I'm going to make a video on that soon showing you guys all the custom stuff and the boots that i make um so that's why i grabbed these random uh rental i mean yeah these like rental style vhs cases uh just for that so this is going to be i am going to rehouse one of my um my boots in this case so that's why i grabbed that and along the same topic this is also for for my recorded stuff although that doesn't sound good Oh no, it sounds like something's wrong in there. I didn't notice that when I grabbed it because it's sealed, but hopefully it's something that can be fixed. Blank. Pretty Woman. I have a stack of Pretty Womans over there and this is just gonna go on there. I don't know. I'm just collecting a bunch of Pretty Womans for fun. This one is uh, Without a Paddle. Uh, I've Seth Green, I've never seen this. Um, Definitely going to check this out. Looks like a fun movie. The X-Files. This is for the resale. Uh, I'm not too much into X-Files. But um, there are people out there that are into that. And I've actually got a bunch of X-Files TV recordings. Um, which I haven't shown you guys yet. Um, if there's anybody in there that's interested in a bunch of X-Files recordings... I'm going to show you guys that soon. Uh, this one is Practical Magic. I'm unsure if I have this already. I might. Uh, but I grabbed it just in case. This one I saw in um, when I was out in Vegas. And I think it was like five bucks. They were selling it for five bucks. Um, so I passed because... I, you know, I always, I always feel like a lot of these titles uh, I'll come across again at a better price, uh, and it came true. Uh, my father, the hero, Gerard Depardieu. Ever since I got that big haul of um, French tapes, I've become a pretty big fan of his. Uh, so excited to watch this. My father, the hero. This one, I don't have. This is Staying Alive. I know I have Saturday Night. Um, what's his other movie? Saturday Night Fever. I think we got another one today, too. So we got a few John Travolta titles. I don't think I have this one yet, though. So this is going into the personal collection. Um, I grabbed this random tape. Oh, this is Fight Club. I came across this last time, and I forgot to grab it. So I grabbed it. It's a loose... It's a loose uh, Fight Club um, tape, uh, but I plan on making a, a boot for that. Well, not a boot, but a, a custom case for that. So that's going to be a project for later on. Uh, the next one is Groundhog Day. 
Bill Murray. I don't think I have this yet. Yeah, I don't have this. So this is going to a personal. Another one I don't have. This is Get Over It. It's got Cisco in it. Kirsten Dunst. Yep. This is like 2000s. This has like late 90s, 2000s written all over it. This one, I, I thought it was like an older movie. Well, it, it is an older movie because it's on VHS. But this is actually a movie from 2001, American Outlaws. Um, so I grabbed that. The Professional, I do have this in my collection already. So this will be for resale. This is a uh, Lawrence Fishburne movie. The, Tuske the Tuskegee Airmen. Never seen that before. And um, this is one of the things that I uh, am starting to collect is these um, like National Geographic or like travel style uh, videos. But um, I just noticed this actually says the Haunted Kingdom of Angkor Wat. So that's going to be pretty interesting. This one is uh, Ancient Mysteries tape. I I love like the the weird unusual stuff like this. That's just some of the stuff I'm starting to collect now. So this next pile, starting off t on the top right here, this is Kundan. I don't have this yet, um, so I'm gonna watch that. This next one is Say Anything. I do have this already, uh, so that will go into the for sale pile. Mountain Men, The Mountain Men. Um, I've passed on this a few times and today I finally grabbed it. So I'm um, gonna check that out. Um, Desperado, this is another one that I am unsure if I have. I think I do though. Antonio Banderas. So that's gonna go in the for sale pile. Here's one for sure I know I don't have is Val Kilmer and Billy the Kid. Definitely don't have that. Looks like a former rental. This one is a pretty cool find. This is Hear No Evil. I do have this already, um, but to find it in the wild, it's pretty cool. I never find stuff like this, not at that store at least. Um, so that was pretty cool. And here's the other John Travolta movie. This is a Saturday Night Fever. This might be a better looking cut. Oh no, never mind. It's got that rip right there. But I do have this already in the collection. So this will go in the for sale pile. This next one is Walk on Water. Um, this one just looked obscure. I've never heard of it. Um, yeah, so we're gonna check that out. Oh. <clears throat> Next one is Jane Fonda, Robert De Niro, and Stanley and Iris. Uh, I've I, When I see older um, De Niro films, uh, I usually just grab them. Um, I am a big fan of Robert De Niro's movies, so glad to add that. This one was interesting to me because I've, I've this is like an older movie. Um, what year is this? This is 1940, it says, so... Uh, this one has got Ronald, a young Ronald Reagan on it. So that just kind of intrigued me. Um, so I picked that up. Probably going to check it out. Next one is The Good Girl. This one has got Jennifer Aniston and Jake Gyllenhaal. I never knew they were in the same movie together. Or they were in a movie together. So that's pretty interesting. These next... Uh, Shells are for resale. This is pretty cool. Digimon. I never come across Digimon tapes. Um, I'm not... Uh, this is not one of the things that I watched as a kid, but I know of. Um, but it's just pretty cool to find it in the wild. So I grabbed it. And we got another big clam here. This one is Tarzan and Jane. I do have Tarzan already, but I don't have Tarzan and Jane. Um, I have a pretty big collection of... Disney clamshell style VHS. So you see them right there. So I do collect this stuff as well. Um, you know, there's just some days where you just want to watch cartoons. So I usually grab those and I have them ready if ever I feel like 
watching something animated or something fun and wholesome that's that's the section i go to um next one this one is deadfall this one i've never heard of this is with nicholas cage um looks like looks like a pretty action-packed movie this one um a few vlogs ago or last vlog i forget which one but I did come across probably a complete collection of the Untouchables uh, tapes. Uh, I did not grab. I did not grab them. I ended up grabbing the uh, the Roots tapes, um, just because they had more value. Um, but this one, I mean, to see it, twenty cents. Uh, I'm gonna check it out. So yeah, here we have some Alfred Hitchcock. Uh, this one is Rear Window. In the big box. I'm starting to have a thing for these these big box, these old big boxes that that they used to have. Um, they just look really cool to me. This one is uh, North by Northwest. All right, the last stack for today. Up top, Bob Marley and the Whalers. I have um. Ooh, he performs "No Woman No Cry." Slave Driver, Concrete Jungle, Jammin', Redemption Song. Oh, man. This is going to stay in the collection for sure. This one I have already, House Sitter. This might be a more fresh copy than the one I have, though. But though that's for resale. Here's another one. Another one of the big clamshells that I've never seen. This one's Alaska. Um, yeah, I usually... Usually when I see films that are, you know, movies that are filmed in the snow, I like those a lot. So I got that. This next one, I just bought this. Um, I got the, I think I got the older release, but I did just get this. I bought it on Whatnot and to find it over there for 20 cents. This is my second copy. So this will be resale. Resale stack. Next one is Bette Midler Gypsy. This is a musical. Um, I don't know. This was a random grab. Uh, but it's a musical. So that will probably go for sale or something. This was the first tape that I saw there today. This is Janet Jackson. The Velvet Rope Tour. Live in concert. I've been finding a lot of these music um, tapes lately. Um, looks like she performed a few good songs on here. So this is probably going to stay in the collection. Yep, it is. This one, I feel like I grabbed this one a few weeks ago. So I'm not sure, but I don't go in the maybe pile. Marked for Death, I already have this, so this will be a resale. Um, but this might be an older release than the one I have, so this one will probably stay with me. Next one is another random... Uh, this is another random grab just for the case. So I'll put that in the project pile. This one, I already have um, the big clamshell release of this um that i got in a trade but i wasn't gonna leave this behind you know it's got that wear on it but it's all good this one i already have this is the abyss um this is the widescreen series so this will be for the for resale this goes in the resale pile um here's another gerard movie gerard depardo movie Germinal. This one is actually sealed. Um, so I'll take that. Gangs of New York. This I do not have on tape yet. Um, so happy to find that one. Here's another one I wasn't going to leave behind. Spaceballs. Um, this is for resale. Buyers love this. Usually an easy sell. 
Next one is White Wolves, A Cry in the Wild, Part 2. This I know nothing about, um, but I saw Zach Morris on the front right there. Zach Morris, I'm saved by the bell. You watching that. All right, we're down to the last two guys. This one is Shattered Image. This seems like an older movie. Um, so it's a screener too, so pretty cool. And check that out. And last but not least, The Wild Wild West, but this is just for the case. Um, I don't know, maybe I'll pop it in for a few minutes. If it doesn't interest me in the first 15 to 30 minutes, then it will be dehoused and I will put a different movie in here. Um, so yeah, that is the haul for today, you guys. I've got a ton of stuff. I got to get rid of a lot of this. I might have to donate a lot of this. Um, if you did see anything, you know, anytime I'm doing a haul, you guys, and you see something that you are interested in, shoot me a message or um, comment on the on the video itself. Uh, and just ask me if I'm I'm willing to sell it. And I'll just let you know if I'm willing to part ways with it. I might be, but, um, you know, when I'm doing my hauls and I say this is for resale, it's usually available for sale. You can direct message me and um, let me know if you want anything because I can definitely use some downsizing here. I am, I have a problem. I'm addicted. I'm addicted to tapes. <laughs>